What's up guys, my name is Torchfer W and today I'm going to do a video on my thoughts on, on the release of Lego Star Wars The Force Awakens. Now, uh, this has been announced sort of like a couple of weeks ago back and today I want to give you my thoughts and my first impressions of the game. So, of course, it's very exciting news. We have not had a Lego Star Wars game since I think well the last uh, Star Wars was the Clone Wars and I can't remember when the when was that released. I think like maybe two thousand seven, eight? I'm not so sure but uh but it was it was before two thousand ten, so that at least six years ago. And so now, uh, the uh, and now we got uh the latest uh, movie, uh, Force Awakens coming to Lego in June, which sounds all very exciting. Uh, and the reason why I wanted to do this video because me personally, I'm not so hundred percent sure it's gonna probably all in that well. I mean, at first we didn't know, of course, the the content of what it's to bring up in the upcoming LEGO game. Uh, what we know is uh, of uh, ex uh, content that is set in between episode 6 and 7. And it's the origins of all the little bits and bobs from from the movie, and I think that is quite exciting because most Lego games, as we all know, from Indiana Jones, Jurassic World, Harry Potter, Batman, all you can every nearly every single one can is more of a series of episodes. Like like with like the first Star Wars game, they you had episode one, two, and three. Which expands to make it more lengthy Lego game, like with the Clone Wars and the Indiana Jones and so on. You get the idea. And obviously with this one, it's just only one episode. Now before the ex uh, the content was released, I was like, now oh, this doesn't sound to be promising. I I think my personal opinion, I just thought we might we might as well just wait until. The um, episode eight and nine was released. Then they can do the uh, logo game of the new sequel trilogy, you know. And uh, but still, it's very nice. But yeah, that's my personal opinion, really. And so I think. Oh, I don't apologize about that. That was me zooming in. But uh, they have released a few couple of uh, images online. And uh, when the trailer was released, it was good old classic Lego, you know. And so, let's give a look. What can we do? So, yeah, and the trailer was uh, like the exact copy of the first official teaser trailer for Star Wars Episode 7. And they basically copied it and then just added the normal Lego humour, which we all love. And so. Yeah, that was, that was a really good trailer, and yeah, it does look all very exciting, and oh, uh, it does look a promising game. Right? So we say we have we haven't seen a Lego game in a long while, and Lego always tends to bring out a new Lego game every single year, and uh, it's just hope. Hopefully, I think the extra new content, I think it might just save this game, really. And, and of course, with all the games, it all comes out on all all platforms. So, Xbox One, PS60, PS4, 3, Wii U, PC, Nintendo DS. And so, yeah, you also get... a uh, a uh, great amount of characters, or is that like Kylo Ren, Finn, Rey, 
because I wonder if we'll get Luke Skywalker because of course as, uh, as we all know um, you know where he comes up in the, in the movie just curious whether they might actually add him you might have to unlock every single gold brick lane to unlock him who knows it might happen um, but yeah that's just a quick video really of really my thoughts on the on the game um, yeah I think that's, that's all I have to say really uh, I don't think there is anything else to mention as I said it's uh, yeah just to recap uh, I, I, um, I was happy of when they released it but I think it would have been a better release if they released on all three episodes rather than just the one and I think the new extra content has just uh, saved the game I think to, from a bit of a letdown because as I said in the previous years we've had all like game series like Jurassic World yeah, I, I don't want to repeat myself, I do apologise for that. And, uh, so yeah, uh, thanks for watching, I do hope you enjoyed this video. I, I do apologise if you've noticed my voice, I've got a dreadful cold, and, yeah, and now my voice is playing up, so I apologise for that. But, once again, thank you for watching, uh, do hope you enjoyed the rest of the day. Uh, comment down below if you are excited. Uh, to play a Lego Star Wars game once again and when the first one released like back like I don't know what 10 years ago I think yeah, I, c I can remember it was the first Lego Star Wars game when I was playing on my Playstation 2 it was a really good Lego game you know the first to bring out the Lego humour anyway uh, thanks for watching uh, take care goodbye